So, part two, and here we go. Um, today, I did work on the sloop elements a little bit more. As you can see, I got a couple of bits in from Bricklink. Um, always, always, always a useful place to get some bits and pieces from. And making, inevitably, Lego, mince pie, cup of tea, definitely the way to go on a winter day. So yeah, just showing some of the um, little ski slope that I decided to work on. Um, and I wanted to have a little bit of a mix of things really this this year. Um, so rather than make traditional brick uh, built slopes, um, I thought, actually, you know what? I quite like to see what it's like to have the um, slope bits rather than having them upright, seeing if we can put them horizontally and see what we can get out of there. So I've actually made a couple of little bits here, which just literally slide on and off um, with some bricks in the back just to support it. And that will just slide in. And we've got a couple of little um, of those, I can't remember, I don't know what they're called, the hinge sort of pieces, um, holding up the actual slope bit. And the kids were having a lot of fun earlier taking the uh, skier and actually making them slide on everything. They had a better go at it than I did. Um, last time it's probably the ski sticks actually getting in the way. Um, but we actually got him to do lots of little flips and things um, off the little kick jump. That was quite a lot of fun. And typically I can't do it when I'm trying to film it. And I may have got a little bit distracted by a side project, but hey, I thought that was quite a cool addition and I really wanted to add this little snow yeti into the scene. Um, so little cave entrance, snowy slope uh, going up to the ski slope and hopefully integrating that all in very shortly. And for the last update of part two, you can see we've done a bit more work. So a little bit more work with the rock work on the side, on the entrance of the tunnel for the train. So I think that's nice and finished now, looking really good, I think. And we've been working a little bit more on some of the snow slopes. I'm trying to just tie this one in up here. I'm going to be making a little bit of a wall to actually make it tie into this section here. Um, not the final placement of the ice skating pond. Um, and yeah, it's got some more bits for the truck, for the tram. And most noticeably, the biggest change, we've got a little train station. So it's not quite finished. Um, but we can see that we've got a couple of benches where people can sit down and working on the inside. It's a very simply made roof, just literally with some plates just kept together and it literally just slides in there and is just kept there like that. And on the inside, there's going to be a little ticket section here and an inside sitting area there. So that will be worked on over the next few days, few weeks. Hopefully get a bit closer for Christmas. <laughs> 